What is up YouTube? Fire Fiend Skin here today and today I want to talk about Hylian and Eli stating that Wind Waker, Twilight Princess and now the most recent Amazon leak Skyward Sword will be possibly be ported over to Nintendo Switch. If that's all you wanted to hear, you can hop off the video. If not, you can stay for some details. Um, other than that guys, I just want to say that Hylian Eli has informed me that he has heard that some Zelda games were being ported over to Switch for quite some time. This was about a week ago when he told me. He wanted to make sure that what he would say was accurate and had some facts before saying anything. After the most recent Amazon post leak, he is somewhat sure of what he has heard, which is that Wind Waker, Twilight Princess, and now Skyward Sword should be coming to switch now with that being said there is no official confirmation from nintendo there is nothing that of a sort however hylian eli is one of the sources that has gotten previous uh direct dates um right on my channel so uh there's definitely that uh my personal opinion um if anything uh with everything that's been going on like you know the 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 trademark renewals for zelda games and a couple of other stuff like that um i personally think that if anything it'll probably be next year since next year is the legend of zelda's 35th anniversary um if anything we could get games along the way that that's probably why hylian eli has heard a couple of games being mentioned but um me personally um you know if they launch this year that'd be great um, if they launch next year, that's probably more possible, but I'm not here to say uh, anything in, or Hylian Eli is not also here saying that everything's confirmed. This is just what he what he's heard. Um, so don't don't take it with confirmation saying that Hylian Eli is saying that they're going to come to switch 100 percent. But that because he's heard of uh, Wind Waker and Twilight Princess before and now the whole Skyward Sword uh leak happened via amazon um it's basically giving him more momentum uh, on that side that he's hearing so it could be true that um alongside skyward sword we would be getting wind waker and twilight princess so i'm gonna go out and personally say that i would be one of those fans that would buy ocarina a time again if they decide to remaster it or reboot it well not reboot it just remaster it or bring it back to life in some sort of way i would definitely be so excited for that i think that'd be um a really good way to celebrate the 35th anniversary to kind of have like all these zelda games into one but again no official confirmation this is just wishful thinking on my part other than that the video is meant for you guys for me to communicate to you guys that at this time Hylian Eli has stated that Skyward Sword, Twilight Princess and Wind Waker should be coming should be coming to Switch at some point, but there is no official confirmation yet. It's just what he's heard. Um nothing else. So uh, that's literally it. Like I said, I'm just making a video letting you guys be aware of what's going on. But other than that, um, that's pretty much it, guys. Let me let me know what you guys think uh, in the comment section below. Um, and then feel free to comment on it. I know on my previous video about the anonymous source on the 28th, um, I just want to clear, clear that out as well. Again, that it's just a video stating that an anonymous source stated that the uh, next direct is on August 28th. And that's really it. Um, I, I, I don't know if that's going to be true or not. I'm hoping it is because, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm just wanting a direct. <laughs> but other than that, that, that's pretty much it. If it doesn't happen, we'll, we'll just move on. Um, same thing with this. You know, um, Hylian Eli has heard some things. But if it happens, great. If it doesn't happen, then we move on. And that's really what it is. Um, so there's that. But other than that, guys, if, like I said, feel free to comment in the comment section below. And until next time, Firebenders, take care. Bye-bye.